Hi and welcome to part 3 of tutorial 100 and uh, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how you can use this little text box that we added to the form right at the beginning but so we're going to use that now to add a symbol so if you wanted to create a little app to do a uh, optimization for a specific symbol then um, this is how you would do that. So what we're going to do at the moment, thus far we've gone through a list of symbols and a list of uh, different bar lengths. What we're going to do is just now do one symbol and uh, the number of different bar lengths. We're also going to set up the error condition. So what I've done to the program is I have uh, removed the genetic optimization just for the moment and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to comment out the opt symbol like so and uh, we're going to replace that with um, the ability to pick up the number or rather than the symbol that we're going to type in that particular text box okay so we're going to do that by saying security dot and then we want symbol is equal to and then we need to use the name of this text text box which I know is text box one but just uh, double check by clicking on the properties so equals text box one and dot text dot to string semicolon so I'm just going to try and verify the program so far and uh, what we also need to do is just put something in the error conditions because uh, I'll show you in a moment um, we can determine if there's a problem with the uh, the optimization there's some error generated you will probably want to see what that is so we can do that here so we're just going to say uh, print then just put in some explanatory text so job failed and then we're going to be getting some information from this so let's say uh, error dot to string like so so let's uh, verify that and uh, go back to trade station so the first thing we can do is let's just try starting an optimization for this text box one text which is uh, obviously not a real symbol so what we should see is an error so there we go you can see job failed optimization etc data data request failed incorrect symbol so let's now try putting in a real symbol and uh, let's start the optimization okay and we can see that uh, now there is an optimization going on and uh, the progress bar is being updated. So anyway, that's just a very uh, quick tutorial as to how you could use this, uh, this text box.